This Laramie Tunsil situation is very interesting. It looks like he has some interest in joining the Cincinnati Bengals. And, you know, can you blame the guy? He's been a part of two, you know, losing franchises. The Miami Dolphin when he was there. And, you know, they weren't successful. And then right now the Houston Texans haven't been, you know, uh, ha you know, haven't been a winning team in two years. So he might be looking, you know, to go somewhere else and play for a contender and if the Cincinnati Bengals could, you know, can pull it off and end up trading for Lemmy Tunsil, I think the conversation needs to be with the first round pick and more. I would definitely love a first and a third for Lemmy Tunsil. Definitely not going to request, uh, you know, the two first round picks because there's no way they give it to us. That was just Bill O'Brien doing whatever he thought he needed to be done. Um, but that's the price market for me if the Houston Texans want to trade Lemmy Tunsil. A first round pick and a third you know, the thing about this is that I'm fine with either or. Because I know that there are tackles in this draft that it's tackle heavy. The free agency market is guard heavy. The Houston Texans can fix their offensive line this offseason through free agency and draft. It's just up to them. Why I like Lermie Tunsil is that he's still 27 years old. He's a top five left tackle in the NFL, and he's just damn good at what he does. Remember his first game against the Saints where he had two sacks? I'm sorry, he allowed two sacks and then didn't allow nothing for damn near the rest of the year? Laramie Tunsil is still a damn good left tackle for the Houston Texans. Was a pro bowler for us, I believe was an all-pro or second all-pro. He is that damn good. And I want him to be protecting Davis Mills. I like Lermie Tunsil. I think that if Davis Mills wants to get better and we want to see him progress into something more, then Lermie Tunsil needs to be in the conversation of being a part of the Houston Texans. But because when he had his injury and he was only supposed to be gone four months, ended up missing the whole year, I'm pretty sure him and the Houston Texans organization had a conversation of whether he, whether he is not going to be here no longer. Now, I think that if the Cincinnati Bengals go ahead and get him, that is a huge get for them. That is what Joe Burrow needs. That's basically what the Cincinnati Bengals need, right? They need an offensive line. At the last play, Aaron Donald made a play. Yes, he was offsides. He still made a play on the football. That meme came to fruition where it is, you know, Burrow, you know, anybody, and then uh, Chase at the bottom, and then there's the other one that hasn't gotten sacked. As soon as the game ended, Laramie Tunsil's name has already been thrown out. Should the Houston Texans go out and target him? They have the 31 pick in the draft. If they add a third, like I said, go ahead and do it. I'm fine either way. If they trade Laramie Tunsil, there are people, I'm sorry, there are players in the draft that you can take a look at. There's people in free agency that you can definitely take a look at. You're also getting rid of the $17.5 million that is owed to Laramie Tunsil, you know, at the beginning of the season. The question is, is what does Nick Casario want to do? I like the idea of adding another first round pick to your arsenal. You're gonna you know, you already have the number three overall. And then the amount of first round picks that you're gonna get for Deshaun Watson, you could go ahead and get a left tackle. Why you also trade Laramie Tones was because of Titus Howard. His his two games at left tackle were his two best games of his career, was graded high on pro football focus. I wouldn't mind Titus Howard being the left tackle for the Houston Texans. That what he that what he was at Alabama State. But let me know what you guys think. Should the Houston Texans trade Lemmy Tunsil or should they not? As always, go Texans. You guys have a very, very blessed day.